Hello everybody, welcome back to Bizarre Repairs and Reviews. On today's video we have the Coda 3600 milliamp hour power bank with wireless charging and built in 4 cable 6 output 15 watt fast charging power bank. Yeah, all that in one. This is a really cool device and I cannot wait to unpack it. So let's get started. Okay, so like I said in the intro, this device is an all-in-one device, solar charger, power bank. You can use this thing to power six devices at once simultaneously. You can charge it four different ways. This is basically the all-in-one unit you need when out and about camping. even comes with a flashlight. So let's get it unboxed and check it out. So as you can see here, we got a nice USB-C cable, uh, one of the ways that we can charge. Inside we have our support information, that's cool. The device itself looks really great. I love that orange color color. As you can see the you have the solar panel there right on the top. The device feels and looks really good. Okay, taking a closer look, you can see the solar panel right on top. You can see that little green indicator light there, which uh, lets us know that the solar is charging. And this is indoors right on the side there this is a little keychain holder where you can put like a carabiner on which it does come included right on the back we have more ports here you can use the USB type C there for input charging and output you have the iOS and you have a USB type A as well right here on this side we have the dual flashlights and the power button and on the back is where the magic happens you have wireless charging built in USB A USB C out micro USB out and lightning out basically all the cables you would need built in the USB A there you can use to charge the device here is the micro USB that would be to charge your device USB C to charge your device and once I get this out here this will be the iOS a lightning cable and I like that it's kind of stuck in there because it's very firm. Uh, that's to charge your iOS devices as well. And you can charge all of these simultaneously. Six devices at once if you'd like. So this is just one of the ways you can charge. So I'm just using the built-in USB-A plugged into an adapter there. And you can charge the device that way. Another way would be to just grab another adapter that's USB-C and plug in right to the bottom there. You can plug in through USB-C and charge the device that way. You can also charge on solar and iOS. To turn on the power, you use the orange button and you press it again and you'll turn on the flashlights. Really nice bright lights. And you'll see the indicator light there. Once again, the green indicator solar light. And to wireless charge, you just place the device right on the back and just make sure the power's on first and you can get your wireless charging going. Now indoors here, I'm just gonna power on the device and see if I can power these three phones all at once since they use three different cables. So first, we're gonna plug in the iOS. Next, it will be the USB-C. And last will be the micro USB have an older phone here that uses that okay now we got all the devices plugged in let's see if they're actually charging okay so there's one charging the second one charging and the third one charging all at the same time awesome for one device to give you three different cables like this, this is really cool. You take this camping, everybody will be fine and pleased because all the cords are taken care of that you can possibly need. All right, last but not least, I'm going to do one more test outdoors just to make sure the solar works and that it also powers these other three devices. So there you go. You see that the solar light indicator is on, so solar charging is working. I have another three devices that I'm just going to plug in just to see.
Okay, so first off, we're going to check out and see if the AirPods are charged. These, the light turns off after a second, so I'm just going to plug it back in to show you. And there you go, the light for the AirPods is on. You can barely see it there, but the orange light is on, so it's charging perfectly fine. Next up, we have this little flashlight of mine. This does not have an indicator light, but we will assume that it's charging. And last but not least, I have this Jeep device used for, it's a satellite phone, and you can see it says charger connected, charging perfectly fine. Flip the device over, and you can get some solar charging while you're at it. What a great device, high quality, nice build, really, really cool device. So I'm going to go ahead and end this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. That was the Gouda 3600 milliamp hour power bank. We'll see you on the next video. Goodbye.